So these days, more than ever before, patients are coming into the clinic already very well informed about atrial fibrillation, the treatment options that are available to them, and the messaging is out already about PFA being a really great option for patients for AFib. Patients, in my experience, have found uh, the procedural efficacy, the safety, and really the recovery time to be the most important aspects of deciding to do an AFib ablation in the first place. And the nice thing is that with the PFA era that we're in now, all those things are actually better from a patient's perspective. So it's been much easier to convince patients to take that next step and to take it again if they should have recurrences in the future that need additional ablation. Our experience with the AFERA system has been great so far from a perspective of the patients and going through the ablation procedure early on as well as at three, six months and so forth. Our patients are really seeing that they're having fewer early recurrences of atrial fibrillation and our staff is getting a lot fewer phone calls about early palpitations after the ablation procedures. Our patients are not really complaining of any chest pain after the procedure and at three months still they're feeling really great from the ablation perspective as well as from the perspective of having fewer AFib episodes as you would expect. Uh, at the six month mark, we've got fewer patients since we're early on in our experience, but so far all of our patients are doing really well and have appreciated their experience. Success to me for an AFib ablation means achieving my procedural endpoints in a safe, effective, and efficient manner. Obviously, helping to reduce the amount of AFib patients are having, the time their episodes are lasting, making them feel better, and doing it in a way that gets them back on their feet and back to their normal life as quickly as possible. I like to think that AFib ablations these days are a relatively small bump in the road for my patients, and that's really been our experience so far with the Medtronic systems.